Oh my goodness. <sighs> Half the things to get excited about on the big screen and being the big child and completely immature that I am, I am very excited. Now time to get excited, yes, about Jenny Morris being in studio, but also about one major thing that is happening right now. It is Avo season. Yes. Oh man, it's officially local Avo season. And in fact, our Avo season has been extended because our amazing Avo cultivars, if we call them that, have put in the hard work. You should be seeing retailers all over the country now. Their shelves should be packed with lovely, beautiful South African avocados. Some of the best in the world, in fact. And this morning, Jenny Morris is showing us how to bring a huge amount of Avo excitement to something that is on many of our weekday family meal plans. The schnitzel. So let's see how oh. we can take it to the next level. But first, I've yes. got to ask you a very important question. What would you like Is to know? the humble avocado a fruit or a vegetable? Well, <laughs> technically, it is a fruit. It's a berry. It's a berry. It's a berry. And Get it's out. got more potassium than a banana, darling. Full yeah. of fibre. It, it's, it's the most amazing nutrient-dense... Uh, uh, Fruit. <laughs> no, and it's, it's got all these beautiful, wonderful fats in it as well. I, yes. I had the opportunity to get to know the guys behind the, the Ever Growers Association. Yes. Do, they've done amazing work to improve our the length of our season. Thank goodness Which affects for that. our pockets as well. Absolutely. Um, but I didn't know that the avocado is 10,000 years old in terms of the cultivation of it. Yep. It actually predates the wheel. There you go. So how can something that's so old not be so good for you? It stood the test of time, and today we are applying it to one of my favorite meals Schnitzel. any day of the week. Caprese. I love schnitzels, and I love caprese salads. <laughs> the fact that we can have these two combined with my now my favorite berry. Absolutely. <laughs> the avocado. That's beautiful. So what's going on here? Well, this is basically the, the classic caprese where you would have um, some tomatoes, okay? like so, and then some mozzarella cheese, which will melt beautifully um, onto mm. your schnitzel. And I'm going to just put the tiniest little bit of salt on that tomato. I have to have salt, and generally oh, I'll have too. black pepper on my tomato, Absolutely. to be honest. I love it, like a Absolutely. Crushed, crushed black pepper, I love. And this is what I love, is the fresh basil, which mm. just screams, it's almost like a, they extended the avo season, the scream summer to me. Completely. Um, so we're going to put some of those beautiful um, leaves onto that and then some avo. What I've done is I've pre-cut it. Um, just look at that. These green-skinned wow, avos. Just beautiful. have a look at that, people. It doesn't get any better than that, trust me. And then you're going to just slice um, over the top um, so you've got the hasp and you've got the, the green skin. The green one, yes. Mm. The hasp. People call it the hoss. It's, it's not a hoss. It's not a, it's not no. a hair. It's, um, it's a hass. It's a hass. Um, and that's defined by the kind of lumpier skin and then the green has obviously got... Oh, it's like me. Skin, it's all, that's smooth like you. That's all lumpy. <laughs> lumpy like me. My little me. boy asked me to shave <laughs> when I, I cut his hair this weekend and he was like, okay, well, then you have to shave, Dad. So I'm actually a little bit smoother oh, than clean? I would be. Yeah. All, all clean shaven. <laughs> and so just have a look at this. The skin comes off just so beautifully. Beautiful. It's the most exciting fruit on the market. What I love about it is if you have a look in the corner, I've got a gorgeous bunny chow there. Mm. And um, I've given you some acha because as you know with all curries one always gets little clever i like that and and what's nice is the avo works so well um that's just going to go straight into the oven or with lucky, the please darling samples are with your acha exactly. i like that that's it's beautiful delicious and i mean you, everyone just kind of does guacamole to be honest with you i just like to take my avo break it open get a spoon in there with some lemon juice olive oil and some rock salt and um, i'm a happy girl a, a hey? strong vinegar oh, i've got this raspberry acidic. vinegar yeah and i'll just i'll cut lines in it so it gets in there yes absolutely delicious, adore it hey? it's beautiful I think I need to have a taste of this, but I'm going to recommend that you guys go to at or follow. I love Avo SA on Instagram and avocado.co.za online or I love avocado SA.co.za to get some background information, but yes. some incredible inspiration on yes. how you can turn any meal into something truly spectacular. Be it a curry, be it a schnitzel, Absolutely. be it just a salad, be it just an avocado. <laughs> and it's got so many health benefits. It can lower your cholesterol because mm. it's got all those monounsaturated, lovely fatty acids. So ever, I'm starving. You can I? It. I see you very Come kindly. Here. Um, were um, forward thinking enough to to create me something special. I'm going to give you some more of this beautiful oh, pesto over the top because pesto and avos are such good friends. Mm. In fact, there's a love affair going on between oh, a pesto. It's an entanglement. Oh, total entanglement. Oh, and look how that. Um, 
Mozzarella has melted. Yep. Absolutely beautiful. What do you think? Mm. Who would have ever thought to just put a couple mm. of slices of ava right over your cheese and tomato, whack it into the oven and eat it while it's nice and hot and happening? Oh, and it's got the you textures. Like it? It's absolutely beautiful. The avo does elevate it completely. If you can go online right now, check out those resources that I've mentioned, but go to expressoshow.com to have a look at all of our culinary inspiration online. This one is a winner. And what I like is normally we kind of overload a schnitzel with kind of creamy sauces yes. and that can make it quite heavy. Oh. This lightens it, it turns it into a beautiful summer dish. Even though it's getting a little bit colder, this is going to freshen you up. I'm going to have nothing. <laughs> you go, boy. <laughs> Absolutely beautiful. Add an avo nurtured in South Africa.